Hey ABC, it's Green Egg. Well, it's the day before Christmas, and a package I've been waiting on finally got it. <laughs> uh, it actually came yesterday, missed it, had to go pick it up, and it was there bright and early this morning to grab it. Could not wait. Uh, what it is, I uh, did a trade with Brother Rui in uh, Portugal. And if you haven't checked out Rui's channel, Rui Martins, you're missing out, man. Just amazing collection, amazing dude, making great videos, showing you know, killer records. If you dig anything I show, you're definitely going to dig his videos, so go check him out. So, uh, I don't know, month, month and a half ago, this all got started over a couple records. And to be quite honest, I can't remember who contacted who about something. And the next thing you know, it just started snowballing and, you know, end up being a couple big packages being shipped back and forth. So I'm hoping uh, you got yours by now, Rui. Uh, if not, should be there very soon. And uh, thanks, dude. Totally appreciate this trade. Everything you sent is amazing. Definitely uh, filled some holes. So let's kind of get started. Uh, got some seven inch singles and uh, some LPs, high, some high roller stuff and then uh, a couple other things. So we'll jump into it. Uh, first up, man, uh, totally loving this band. If you've seen any of my recent videos, I've mentioned them several times. But it's uh, the new 7-inch from Savage Master, Black Hooves. I'm really excited to get this. Salt was out. I was like, man, cannot wait. And the B-side is a cover of one of my all-time favorite metal songs, which is Swords and Tequila by Riot cannot wait to hear yeah their version of that I haven't heard uh, any of these yet other than one and I'll kind of explain when I get to that one but uh, been kind of staying away I'm sure I can find clips online but I was waiting on the package I want to hear it when the uh, needle drops so all right next up a band out of Spain uh, hitting don't be don't be late uh, brain lock up really cool band uh, kind of turn on to this band uh, by Renee, of course, you know, who's totally up on all the bands coming out of Spain. And uh, this guitar player was also in, I don't think he's in them or with them anymore, a band called Iron Curtain. And here's their brand new EP. This is a four song, seven inch on high roller. It's called Outlaw. Another killer Spanish metal band. And a new single from Amulet, Bloody Night, from Sweden. New Wave Traditional Heavy Metal. Yeah, just like uh, Hitten and Iron Curtain. Very, very cool. Excited for all these, man. Thank you so much. The High Roller Collection is just <laughs> growing every day. Okay, one more High Roller. And we're into the LPs now. I uh, was very excited about this coming out. Been waiting for a while and it just hasn't showed up anywhere uh, that I order from here in the U.S. So while doing the trade, Rui offered to grab a copy. I'm like, yeah, dude, that'd be great. Uh, right after emailed that the package was in the mail, this album showed up <laughs> on one of the sites I order from. And uh, being the sick record collector that I am, I ordered a copy. It actually came a couple days ago, and I've been spitting the crap out of it. I was so excited to get this, it was like I couldn't wait, and I knew Rui's package was gonna take a little while coming from overseas and blah, blah, blah. So anyways, got two copies of this now, hanging on to both, love this album. Ambush, Desecrator, brand new album from Ambush on High Roller and Wow, these guys, this is, uh, first album was great, this album is just blowing me away. Hopefully, glare isn't too bad. New Wave Traditional Heavy Metal, uh, if you haven't checked out Ambush, do so. If you dig Black Trip and, uh, Enforcer and just that whole deal, you will like Ambush. Actually, uh, I was talking to LJ, I was like, who's better, man, Ambush or Enforcer? Like, man, that's a hard call. But uh, I went with Ambush, man. I'm leaning definitely towards this band. Love Enforcer, but this album, 
uh, kind of put them over the top for me. I'm totally digging that. Okay, next up, there's actually three reissues. Very excited to get all of these, man. Uh, this one I've had on bootleg CD for years. I've never seen it on vinyl, never seen an original, and saw this reissue on vinyl. I was like, man, I got to track that down. And Rui came through, man. Found a copy for me. Uh, it's Taste of Iron Resurrection. Uh, I think these guys were from Washington State, if I'm remembering right. Female singer. This album come out in 84. Very cool. Just that 80s underground, kind of a power metal, I guess you could say. Very cool album. Happy, happy to have that, man. Thank you so much, dude, for tracking that down for me. Uh, next up, a French band, Voodoo Child Adrenaline. I think this was from like 85. And I've heard some of this. I'm not, and I may even have this on a boot somewhere, but I don't remember it too well. So, uh, but I do know it's a good album, so I'm excited to check it out and really uh, drop the needle on it and really check it out. And next, super happy to get this, man. Uh, I got it on CD, uh, I don't know, back in the summer or something. Saw a couple people show it. I know one for sure was Mibber, I think, showed it on vinyl. And I was like, oh, i got to track down the vinyl reissue of that. And it's Harlot. 25 gets a ride. These guys were from Michigan. Uh, it's come out in 1988. And it's just a badass 80s metal album. If you've never heard them, uh, you can definitely find clips on YouTube. Check them out. Just a really, really cool band. So, and uh, here's the label. Blood and Iron. All right, uh, that's it. Just an amazing trade with Rui, man. Thank you so much, brother. I hope you got your package by now. By now, here before Christmas. If not, it shouldn't be very much longer. And I hope you enjoy everything in your package as much as I definitely am going to be enjoying these. <laughs> Killer trade. Uh, yes, that's it. Uh, I hope everybody has great Christmas been a fantastic year here uh 2015 in the bc probably do another update video for the end of the year and i'm toying with doing a best of man those things are so hard those videos and uh, i applaud everybody that's doing them uh i just get to i think about it too much so if i do one it's just going to be whatever comes off the top of my head at the moment and uh, i might try doing that instead of going crazy and trying to Kapow everything and blah blah blah, but we'll see. Uh, I haven't done one. I did one uh, 2013. I didn't do one in 14. Should do one. We'll see. <laughs> Thanks to everybody who comments and subscribes and watches these goofy videos. Love being in the BC. Looking forward to another year coming up. Uh, I think I'm coming up on my fourth year. That's crazy. So, all right, BC. That's it. Have a great Christmas. Later.